Hola, como estas mi amor? Mi amo que y today hola cote me Ada I don't know how to speak Spanish. What's up y'all, Koi Max aka Today we here to look at an SML movie. Bowser Jr. finally learns Spanish? Bowser Jr. learns Spanish. Now as you can tell from the intro, I I I I Hispanic, so I don't know how to speak Spanish. The most I can give you, I can give you a hola, I can give you a como te vu, I can give you a konnichiwa, that's all I can get. That's it, that's it, you know what I mean? Uh, but regardless, we'll go watch this video. Anyways, uh, hopefully, hopefully you guys enjoy it. If you do, you already know what to do. I say it in every single video. You already, you already know what to do. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and check this video out. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. If you do, uh, uh, yeah, 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 uh-huh, uh-huh. All right, class. Today, we're gonna be learning how to speak Mexican. You're gonna need to know how to speak Mexican. Because one day, That's you're messed gonna up. find yourself at a Mexican restaurant. And the waiter's gonna bring you your food and say, hot plate. But you're gonna touch the plate anyway and burn your hand because you didn't understand what they said because they were speaking Mexican. Hey. So we're gonna learn <laughs> how to speak Mexican. Yeah? Any questions, Crash? Um, it's not called speaking Mexican. It's called speaking Spanish. Spanish, Mexican, same thing, Cody. What do they speak in Mexico? Mexican. See, hey, down. listen. Hey, that's hey, that's that. He got a point. In Mexico, they speak Mexican. In Spain, they speak Spanish. In America, they speak American. That hey, that makes sense to me. Hey, hey, listen. This is why he the teacher. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Okay. Well, what do they speak in Spain? Mexican. <laughs> what about Puerto Rico or Cuba? <sighs> they all speak Mexican. Cody. <laughs> but we'll Spanish for you. You wrote Spanish on the board. All right, class. No one pay attention to Cody. He dumb. He not know Mexican. <laughs> Facts. Does anyone know how to say hero in Spanish? What about you, smartass? The Spanish word for hello is hola. No, that's how you say hero in Hawaiian. I yeah. Asked how you say hero in Mexican? I mean Spanish. Yeah. Right. Either so one. How you say hero in Spanish is. I ain't gonna lie. I, I used to do that. Like I'll put the O over everything. I'll I either put the L in the front or I'll put an O at the end. So if it's the cell phone, it's the cell phone. Or if it's the or if it's the box, it's the it's the box of, you know? Or if it's my hand, it's the El Hando, you know? Let's Listen, I know. Listen, I know a little bit of Mexican. I can't lie to you. I know. I know a little bit of Mexican. Just a little. Just a. Just a. Just a tad. Now that you all know how to say hello in Spanish, we're gonna learn how to say bye in Spanish. Bye. The way you say bye in Spanish is adios. El bye. God damn it. So <laughs> el hello, oh, crass. El hello. El bye. El bye. Yep. What? Are you kidding me? You can't just add L and O to the beginning and end of every word. You can. Spanish now. All right, class. Now that you know how to say bye in Spanish, you're probably wondering how do you say this bye in Spanish. Well, it's very similar to this bye, except El bio. This is El bio. So the difference between Listen. El bio. The teachers taught me all the wrong things. This actually makes a hundred percent sense. This makes this makes a lot of sense, bro. Just it this is a lot easier. Just throw the O in the back, put the L in the front. That makes sense. All this Ola what, what was the word? Adios. Too complicated. I like this. I like this. This should to be honest, this should have been my Spanish teacher when I was in school. It should have been my Spanish teacher. I'm mad. I'm, I'm, I'm like, and El Bayo is this by you're gonna say it while you're waiting. So El Bayo and this by you're gonna say it with money in your hand, like you're gonna buy something. Yeah. I'll buy you. What? What if you don't have any arms? That doesn't even make sense. Well, you better have arms if you go to Mexico, <laughs> Cody, or else no one's gonna understand you. All of this pointless if you don't have arm. Arm is very important for yeah. the Mexican language. So this buy and this buy, no one's gonna understand you if you don't have arm, because they're gonna think you're trying to buy something and leave at the same time. Anyway, That'd be confusing. Guys, so now that you know how to say buy as in El Bayo and buy as in you're gonna buy something, 
Now you're probably wondering, how do you say this by? This by is like this book was written by. Yeah, the yeah, yeah. Okay. This by in Mexican is. Let me guess. Is it El Bio? No. No, very close, Cody. Very close, but they different. The way you say right. by in Spanish is. El Bio. That's what I just said. <laughs> well, what you do with your hands is very important, Cody, because the way you say this by is El Bio. Yeah. And the way you say this by is. El Bio, you have to have money in your hand. <laughs> and in the way you say hey, this makes sense. This, buyer, this makes sense. El Bio, you must have book in your hand. See, book is written El Bio, Dr. Sue. Hey, y'all see it on the book? It says buy. Y'all see it? Makes sense to me. Put one and one together, you get 12. It makes sense. No, why don't we just learn regular Spanish? This is very complicated. I know. I know, Crass. Mexican can be very confusing. So <laughs> let me use That's... all three buys in a sentence to help you understand. So what you're going to do is you're going to walk into the library and say, El Hero, oh, Mrs. Librarian, I would like to El Bio, a book that was written El Bio, Dr. <laughs> Seuss. So you're going to take your money and now you own book. But before you leave, you're gonna set the book down. Yeah. And say, El Bayo, you cannot say El Bayo while holding book in your hand, or else you look like this. Okay. El Bayo, El Bayo, like, who wrote this fucking book? You know who wrote the fucking book. It says Dr. Seuss on the side of the book. So yeah. you have to put the book down and say, El Bayo, then you can pick the book back up. I learned so much in four minutes and 44 seconds that I ever learned in all of my schooling. Y'all gonna see every video. El hello o Quay Max, aka Quay. And then at the end of every video, I'm gonna be like, El Bio. You feel me? That's 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 how it's gonna have to go down. That makes a lot of sense, though. Any questions, class? Nope. Yeah, I'm dropping out of this school. All right, class. We're running out of time. So we're gonna go through these last three very quickly. All right, the next word we have El is Nemo. Name. How you say name in Mexican is. Nemo. Okay. Bingo Nemo. was his name. Very famous <laughs> Spanish song. Word. B I N G O. And Bingo was his name. Okay. The next word we have is yes. Does anyone know how to say yes in Spanish? Yes, sir. Si. Come on, guys. I thought you were smarter than that. The way you say yes in Mexican is. <laughs> Mex. El Yeso. Oh. Everybody understand? Gotcha. All right. The last word is. No. Does anyone know how to say no? And El no. -o? Oh, I got it now. It's El no. -o. What? What? What kind of Spanish is that? Cody, you are so dumb. You have a lot of Spanish to be learning. The way you say no in Spanish is no. No. <laughs> no in all languages. Hey, you that's be so stupid. El no. <laughs> Oh, it makes okay. sense. Oh, yeah, that's fair. I was just putting L and O at the beginning and end of every word like you were. Oh, come on, Cody. This is getting really easy. Spanish is easy. Screw off, Junior. All right, Chris. I know some of you had trouble hey, that makes sense. learning your Spanish today. But what I want you to do is tonight go to Mexican restaurant and try to test out your Spanish. See how far along you get. All right, and remember, if they say hot plate, that means ow, no touch. Do not touch it or else you burn your hand. I'll no oh, touch. I know we didn't get to food items today, but remember, burrito and taco are same thing in Mexican. And also, when in doubt, add L and O to the word, and you're probably right. Uh, <laughs> probably. Uh, what a Maybe. long and exhausting day of school today, Cody. Yeah, I know. It's almost like we didn't learn anything at all. But yes, we did, Cody. We learned Spanish. No, we didn't, Junior. Nothing that he taught us was actually Spanish. Yes, it was, Cody. He's a teacher. He knows what he's talking about. He's an idiot. He doesn't know what he's talking about. And nothing he taught us was real Spanish. Hey, okay, Cody, look, I understand that, you, you know, we only know English, so learning a new language is going to be hard for us. So I understand hearing another language is going to sound like gibberish. So, yes, Spanish right now doesn't make sense to us, but eventually we're going to speak fluent Spanish, and it's going to make sense. Jim, yep. I've already learned a little bit of Spanish. Yeah, today. What? No, no, I mean before today. Like, like earlier today? No, no, I, I mean even earlier than that, like yesterday. What? Like, no, I didn't learn Spanish yesterday. I learned Spanish like a while back. 
like how long like like earlier today like a few no hours. no not a few like like a, few like years a long ago. time ago like, okay cool your time's all messed up a few years ago no like no, I mean, no, earlier today junior nothing we just learned today is real spanish i promise oh, okay then let's go to the mexican <laughs> restaurant and test it out like he wants us to do and we'll see if it works or not yeah we're gonna sound stupid no we're not we're gonna sound like we're spanish <sighs> fine mexican go, cody oh man this is my first time at a mexican restaurant this is so cool I like the hat. Hat kind of fire. Yet our teacher says we have to test out our Spanish at a Mexican restaurant. So we're at a Mexican restaurant. Let's test out our Spanish. Junior, we don't even know real Spanish. Our teacher is an idiot, and we're just gonna sound stupid. Cody, we're not gonna sound stupid. Is that real cactus? <laughs> no, Junior, that's a balloon and a sombrero, and we're gonna sound stupid because we're just adding L and O to everything. And besides, I can't even eat Mexican food. It'll tear apart my butthole, not in a good way. Oh, el hello, senors. I brought you some chips and salsa and queso and soft cream. Well, oh, that look good. My name is Burrito Taco Burrito, but you can call me Taco. That is not your real name. Oh, yes, so it is, senor. What is your name? <laughs> Mi nombre es Cody. What? My name is Cody. Ah, oh, bingo was his name. What's your name? <laughs> oh, uh, uh, El Hello O. My name O Jr. Ah, bingo was his name. You bingos want to order some food? Um, I, I just like to buy a taco and an enchilada. What? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I, I'd like to el bio a taco and an enchilada. What? Oh, you're leaving so soon? See you later. No, no I'm not. I'm not leaving. <laughs> Gotta get the money. El bio a taco and an enchilada. There you go. Ah, taco and enchilada for bingo. What about you, bingo? Oh, uh, I would also. I mean, uh, uh Cody, can I borrow that? Yeah. <laughs> hey yo, imagine you actually at a Mexican restaurant. You see you over here eating your food. You see somebody over here across the table. I like the El Bayo, this burrito, you feel me? And this El Bayo, this enchilada. You probably look at him like, wow, he really knows his Spanish. God, he really on his P's and Q's. I gotta get like that, okay? Taco and enchilada also. Oh, okay. Two enchilada. Two taco coming right up for the bingos. Junior, this is ridiculous. Cody, look, we're doing we're doing pretty good with our Spanish. You're, you're killing it with your Spanish. You said you didn't know it, but you're killing it. Junior, this is stupid. This isn't even real Spanish. Cody, let's see some nachos. <laughs> All right, bingos, your food is ready. Hot plate. Ow. What's wrong, Cody? I burned my hand on the plate. Well, you said hot plate. They said don't touch it. Touch. You know that. Well, he touched it and it didn't hurt him. Here you go, senor. Hot plate. Oh, that's a good point, Cody. I'm gonna ask him. Uh, L, excuse me, O. L, what, though? L, uh, <laughs> how, O, oh, did you, O, oh, touch the hot plate, O, oh, without it burning your hand, O? Oh. oh! Bingo, what's his name, O? Oh? He's, ah! Oh. Uh, well, I think he's just really busy. Yeah, that's probably right. I can't wait to try this food, though. It looks really good. Try yours. Junior, I said I can't eat it, because if I do, I'm gonna have a baby out of my butt. Well, Cody, maybe Batch. this is diet. Oh, you know what? You're, you're, yeah, you're right, Junior. It's probably diet Mexican food. I diet Mexican. That. I guess I'll try it then. Yeah, it might be diet. As much as I love, love, love Mexican food, if I were to eat something like that, my butthole is going to be in shambles. I'm telling you, like 10 minutes later, at the 10, 20, 30 hour later, right? I'm going to be stuck in that toilet for like three hours. They're like, dang, Quay. Hold on, Quay. It's Easter. You still on that toilet? Hey, man. I'm going through it right now, bro. I'm sorry. I'm going through it. I shouldn't. I, I know it was good, but I should not have had them enchiladas and them burritos. It just, it was, it's definitely hitting different. <laughs> Make you sick. Mm, mm, these diet beans are actually really good, Junior. Oh, Cody, you should try this enchilada. It's amazing. Yeah. Uh-oh, uh-oh. What's wrong, Cody? Got them bubble guts. Did you burn yourself? Uh, no, no, Junior. I got a poop. I got a poop really, really bad. Uh oh, well, then use the bathroom, you weirdo. No, no, Junior, I never use public bathrooms. Cody never poops in public. Cody pooping in public, never gonna happen. I never pull a CPP. You never pull a CPP? No. Well, you poop in private, right? Well, well yeah. So that's a CPP, Cody poops in private. Well, well, it's a CPP, but it, it's not the same kind of CPP. Look, it doesn't matter, Junior, I have to poop. We need to leave right now. So you want me to get the check? Yes, please. Where's the waiter at? Uh, waiter, uh... Waiter, waiter, get over here. Did you need something, Bingo? Yes, I have to poop. I, I need to check right now. Oh, we're actually running a special today. If you El Bio this book, then your meal is free. What? I don't want to buy a book. I just want to pay for my dinner. Well, that's a good deal, Cody. If, if you buy the book, your meal is free. We basically ate for free. Well, yeah. It's not free if I'm buying the book, Junior. But the meal is free, senor. Yeah, it's, it's a good deal, Cody. Well, okay, okay, fine. I will buy your stupid book. What? 
Oh, you're leaving so soon without paying? You dine in ditch? <laughs> you dine in ditch? book. Oh, okay. Better doing business with you, senor. Okay, can we can we go now, Junior? Wait, he paid twenty for the book? El Bio. Doctor Seuss. Oh, Cody, you said buy while holding the book, didn't you? Are you farting, Cody? Junior, Junior, I, I pooped in my panties. What? I pooped in my panties, Junior. Panties? I have mesh panties, and I just made Play-Doh spaghetti in my pants. <laughs> uh, uh, That's oh, disgusting. Cody, look, at least we learned Spanish, and you and you bought a book, just like the teacher taught us. So you do know Spanish, Cody. You learned Spanish. <sighs> oh, oh, God, it won't stop. Oh, God, it won't stop, Junior. Just keep pooping. <sighs> <laughs> what, 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 oh, man. What a weird dream. Oh, man. Come on, that was a Cody. dream? Come on, Cody, answer. Hello? Cody, I just had the weirdest dream. I had a dream that we were in school. And we you were dreaming? Spanish, and then we went to a Mexican restaurant, and, and you bought a book, and then you pooped your pants. That wasn't a dream, Junior. That was earlier today. I'm oh, still on the mind. toilet. Now hang up so I can finish reading Green Eggs and Ham. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> All right, that's, that, 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 that's the SML movie about the dream learning Spanish. More of the story, just add the L at the front, add the O at, 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 at the end. And you got Spanish, you got it down packed. You don't need a Rosetta Stone, you don't need to look at any YouTube videos, and you don't need to listen to your Spanish teacher. So anytime you go to Spanish, anytime you go to Spanish class, she try to tell you some, some nonsense, just remember, you watch this video, uh, and you already know your Spanish, so you can go ahead. Also too, more of the story, don't, don't, don't eat too much Mexican food, cause you, you're gonna have them bubble guts and nobody wants bubble guts. So uh that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, you know what to do. Like, comment, and subscribe. You know? Quemax AK Quay. I'm out. I'm gone. Like I'm I'm listen, listen. I'm gone. Ooh. Hold on, wait. Ooh. Wait, hold on. Ooh. Wait, one more time, one more time, one more time. Ooh.